I got prize picks for Friday, September 1st. I'm Sniper from DFS Army. Going to talk MLB today. Going to do a quick video this morning. You're looking at the DFS Army Proptimizer. Going to pull two plays from it to get you started. Smash that like button for me. We're going to start right up at the top. Jordan Lyles. Five and a half strikeouts is or five and a half hits allowed is the prop. Juice is pointing towards the under projection, pointing towards the over. It's the power of this tool. These two things don't line up. It takes you one step further than just the odds-based tools. I'm not going to play Jordan Lyles. I'm going to go down to Jake Irvin. Jake Irvin, we got five on the hits allowed line here. Five and a half is minus 102 at Caesars. You get a push on five. We're projecting at 5.43 hits allowed against Miami. Head on over to his uh, last seven starts. Last seven starts, he's averaging, he's given up 38 hits. That's over a five average. Last 15 starts, again, it's 82. Uh, it's like that's five, about, about five and a half hits allowed. So pretty good there. I'm going to head over to prize picks. Give me one second here, guys, to switch over the tab. Pull up Jake Irvin. Five hits allowed. As you can see, two pushes, two wins, just one loss here. Odds pointing that way. Proptimizer here helping us out. That'll be play number one. Make sure you sign up at DFS Army. Links are in the description. Got that tool for all the major sports that are starting up and picks in the Discord for sports for additional plays, not from the Proptimizer. Great service there for under 30 bucks a month. I'm going to head over back to the Proptimizer to find play at number two in the day. I'm going to go with Josh Rojas. The board is a little bit thin this morning. Cal Quantrill, as you can see, the Proptimizer also has some news here. Um, I guess Quantrill is now out, or at least dealing with an injury. So no way I want to play him here, even though the odds would have it as a pretty decent play. I'm going to go to Josh Rojas. I suspect this play is going to get taken off the board, so you don't like the video. If you're not a DFS Army VIP, you might miss this one. But Josh Rojas, minus 140 total bases, basically just to get a hit. Um, 140 a point bet, 135 DK, pretty solid odds. Head over to Josh Rojas's player page, last seven games. Man's hitting 348, 8 for 23. Last 15 games, 347, 17 for 49. Uh Taking on the Mets today, I believe that's uh, Kodai Senga, I believe, in that matchup. Either way, though, minus 140 just to get a hit. Guys hitting really solid the last two weeks of the year. I'm going to go ahead and we'll flip over to prize picks. And that's going to be play number two for the day, unless something really crazy stands out to me here in the last five for total bases. Three wins, two losses. Looks pretty good to me, obviously. Um not any kind of crazy slump. Minus 140 sounds good, especially on what I think is a pretty tight board. Go ahead and we'll play Josh Rojas more than 0.5 total bases. So that's going to be our play for the day. I'll do the quick recap. Jake Urban, more than five hits allowed. Josh Rojas, more than 0.5 total bases. Make our play. We lock that in. That's what I got for you guys today. One more time, smash that like button. Hope you like the content. You got WN tomorrow here on YouTube. I'll be back in my home office on Sunday. So hope you've enjoyed this week of content. I hope you've cashed some winners. DFS Army VIPs had a really good week in the Discord. I'll share some of those screenshots with you probably on Sunday. But for now, this is your daily reminder of whether or not you are a DFS Army member. You probably should be. But either way, good luck in those contests, and I will see you next time.